Long ago, two races ruled over the earth. One day, war broke up between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters on the ground with a magic spell. Many years later, Mount Ebot, 2001X. Let us say that those who climbed the mountain never returned. Hey everyone, welcome to a new Let's Play of Undertale! Don't worry, because we're gonna Mario still be uploaded, but you know. Undertale! I think I promised you guys. I think. Well, here we are playing as young... Whatever you want your name to be. And such, I am playing with a PS4 controller, so I'm still gonna be using controls because I haven't actually fixed the controls yet. Doobly doobly doo. Whatever, let's go talk to young Flowey. Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hmm? You're new to being on the ground, aren't ya? Golly, you might be so confused. Someone ought to teach you things or how work things around here. I guess a little older me how to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very combination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow if you gain a lot of LV. What does LV stand for? Why, love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. You idiot! In this world, it's kill or be killed! Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Oh god. DIE! Eh? Ah! What a terrible creature! Torturing such a poor, innocent youth. 
Oh, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day. See if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. The shadows of the ruins loom above you, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Okay, um, I think I'm gonna stop it there because she just called me an innocent. Nah, I'm joking. Allow me to educate you in the operations of the ruins. Mm hmm. The ruins are filled with puzzles, ancient fusions between the Avengers and Zord Keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the side of them. Oh, the only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones, both walk not the middle road. Isn't brave and fearless the same thing? To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Don't worry, I have lived with the ones you need to flip. Press B. <laughs> really, really, really. Like, we haven't known that because we just pressed that. Well, I have to play with the controller, so I. Stay on the path. Toby. Toby Fox. Screw you. The first switch is over the wall. Press the switch. Press the switch, Toriel. Press the switch, too, Toriel. Go on. Press the switch on the left. Uh, wait, wait, wait. I'm left handed. No, 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 no. You wanna press this other switch? I even leave with it for you. What? Well, but, but I'm curious. Whatever. Splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Little one, really? Let us move to the next room. This switch doesn't even work. <coughs> okay, that's, that's what I guess for crying. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for the situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. When you're in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. I'm trying to pick up a good joke, but I can't. Stop for the time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Do you need some ideas for your conversation topics? Well, every start with a simple, how do you do? How can you ask them about their favorite books? Jokes can never be useful, breaking the ice. Listen to this one. What did a skeleton tie his roof with? Thin goes. I did not read that before when I played this. Well, I thought it was amusing. Also, for every joke I made until it will add to that old pun counter I used to use in the past, okay? Even from me. You got to the dummy. Okay. Don't be standing around. I thin the been dead. The I can't read. <laughs> oh God. Dummy looks like he's going to fall over. Okay. There's an actual thing that's gonna happen if you keep. Dummy, tie yourself of yours. <laughs> you want earning a zero XP and zero gold. Look at her face! That's the priceless part about doing that. Um, uh, the next human waits. <laughs> what? What? And I gotta say anything? I'm gonna be a bitch? Not? All right, I gotta pick my controls when I have the chance. The um, no. There's a reason why I call myself Kara, and it's gonna be, it's gonna be in the, later in the end game. There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Frog gonna talk to you. I say I complimented, but it was kind of loud anyways. And her face. I love their face. 
the western room is in the is in the eastern room. Ah, oh, whatever. I can't read that. Um, hello, Soria. This is a puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. Damn it! I wanted to kill myself. God damn it, Toria! I wanted to kill myself. Even though this looks like this is an adorable moment. I like her sprite. Like, the overworld sprites are not that good, but, but hers is. That's adorable. But it seems a little too dangerous for now. Yeah, I see, you can't even do anything. It won't allow you on there. You've done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request for you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Toria, why? Ah, ah, I am so frightened. Why is the screen not full screen? Whatever. Ba -ba ah, Jesus Christ, I'm gonna die. Ah, ah, ah. This is longer than I thought. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Greeting, my child. Do not worry. I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar to hold. How stupid does she take us to be? Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for the attempt, Stars. To test your independence. I'm sorry, it's not Independence Day. I'm gonna attend to some business and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I'll give you a cell phone. If you, need for, if you just need anything, just call. Be good, alright? Is it Toriel? You only want to say hello? Well then, hello. I hope that suffices. No! This is Toriel. You want to say hello again? Salutations. Is that enough? No! This is Toriel. Are you bored? I should have given you a book to you. Uh, manga, please. No. Well, I can read any book if it's not a chapter book. Chapter books are just boring. Why? I'm not patient enough to read uh, freaking chapter books. I like. Bo I don't. I don't. I'm not a big fan of books. My apologies. Why don't you use your imagination to read? Return of SpongeBob. Imagination. Pretend you're a monarch. What the hell is a monarch? I'm not kidding. What the fuck is a monarch? Monarch. 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 <laughs> uh, mon. Ark. The hell is a monarch? That's not helping. A monarch butterfly is a simp or a simple monarch is a milkweed butterfly in a. I'm not gonna be a butterfly. Rule over the leaf passes is with a fist of. I'm sorry. I don't think butterflies have a fist. I have even of iron. It's ironic you say that. Hey, he did that for me. This is Toriel. Hello, my child. Sorry, I do not have much to say. Do I have to hear your voice though? Yeah, afterwards, she just loops. It's the kind of thing that Toby Fox does. Alright, let's, let's, let's talk, let's know, I want to know about Toriel. This is Toriel, you want to know about more about myself? Hmm, I'm afraid there's not much to say. I miss a silly little old lady who worries too much. And let's call her mom. This is Toriel. Huh? Her face is adorable! Do you just call me... Mom? Well, I suppose. Would that make you happy? They call me... Mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Good. I'm a okay, I'm done. <sighs> Speaking about that... Huh? Oh. Heh. 
<laughs> How adorable. I could pinch your cheeks. You certainly find better than an old woman like me. And then I get reminded of an arc and nope. <laughs> ah, you didn't hear anything. Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There's a few puzzles I had that I have yet to explain. It worries me dangerous that you try to solve them yourself. Be good, alright? Ribbit, ribbit, excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight to, until they almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight, please use some mercy, human. Ribbit, well, I have a friend that would not care for that one. I'm looking at you, Slayer. If it says take, it says take one. Take a piece of candy. Take a piece of candy. You took more candy. How disgusting. Take off candy. You take another piece of candy. You feel like this is come of the earth. You took too much. Too fast. The candy spills onto the floor. Look what we get done. Okay, I'm done. And yeah, monster candy. If you check, um, you got at least four. It heals 10 HP, which is, yeah, uh, which is half. So yeah. Please go quickly into the leaves filled you with determination. Oh, uh, give me a sec. Uh, screen might go down for a bit. Um, uh, yeah. I think it's gonna be good for now. So hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Undertale. And see you guys in the next one. Bye!